All right, uh, I ran across a question on devices, which seemed a little bit confused. Okay, uh, the back end here is uh, LHY Studios. That's the M2 Nano. Uh, it also has like B2 and M1 and a bunch of boards that I've never actually seen in real life. Uh, these can, the boards are defined here and uh, some of the very specific items. So I have mock on, but device index is where the USB connects. So uh, in USB uh, log, when you connect, it'll tell you some of the things where it's connected. It also has a chip version. This is the uh, CH341 chip, I believe. Uh, the C, yeah. Something like that. Uh, the chip version you can set, it'll tell you what the chip version is. Basically what this is trying to do is uh, lock on to just one of your devices since they're gonna run basically the same. If you have different chip version, you can make it so that it skips it based on chip version. So if you have multiple uh, K40s, it'll run like that. And that's really what devices is supposed to do. Like here I have uh, two devices this is the device one that's what this number up here is is the device number the state is uh booted uh location unknown true false this is whether it boots or not at the very beginning so if you have it set like this when you start up uh meerkat it'll load two different uh two different scenes and one for each of your devices and then they sort of share the stuff it didn't work very well uh but that is what this does. So when you click here, it says what type of device is being added and it only has one choice. That's because I only have one backend. This is where I would put like a Moshi board if I finish Project Moshi or Ruida or G-Code, whatever thing. This is where it goes. So when you go here, it loads up another one. Let me turn that one to boot off. And these each have independent settings and they configure internally as a different device. So in, uh, let me run regedit. Uh, yes, run regedit. Okay, here is my registry for Meerkat. This is the first device. It has a bunch of uh, stuff. This is the second device. This is the third device. It also has a uh, key map and operations, etc. cetera. Uh, basically each device gets its own set of settings so you can have different boards and it configures things for that specific device it's mostly so that if you have multiple k40s but if you had a different back end you'd uh set up a different driver here though there are no current back ends so for the most part devices is pointless and it will automatically give you an uh m2 nano just by default which is uh precisely what you want and then I'm right clicking to turn the boot on and off here. I don't know if that's ever been covered, but basically you can make it boot, make it not boot. Uh, it'll load these things up. Uh, hopefully in the future I can figure out a way to make it work better. Uh, if you have multiple devices and you try the run and you have some better workflow suggestions, uh, please raise an issue, post them on the GitHub or notify me some other way. All right, and that should cover devices and you know how it works. The other thing is it doesn't really have anything to do with connections. It basically defines the devices you have and in preferences, it defines specifically the criteria that defines the device, but it doesn't actually do any of the connection or any of the rest of it. Uh, in controller, you can uh, force a connection to the USB and that will uh, try to log on. I don't have it connected right now, so it will go there. And then in USB log, it'll tell you uh, whether it connected and what it's trying to do with the connection. Otherwise, it will wait until such time as you uh, start a job and need to do a connection. So you can start the job and it has something more than a beep, which doesn't require anything. So if I threw this in here and said, start job, now it has to cut and do some other stuff. And then it uh, attempts to start the job, which, uh, logs up here and then is trying to connect to the USB and you can tell that it's attempting connection to the USB because I told it to run something that requires it. All right. Uh, that is, uh, how you connect to the thing. It has very little to do with the devices. Devices just tells the, uh, tells Meerkat what, uh, things you have, not, uh, when to connect them. 
All right. Uh, thanks for watching.